don't know. You ever feel like the girl from Nightmare Before Christmas? No, I don't watch dumb shit for ugly girls who can only be pretty by being alternative. Damn, that kind of ruins my depression tangent. Like you think I'd watch a cartoon after the age of nine. What about Family Guy? That's not a cartoon, it's for adults. Are you sure? Why would it reference the 80s so much if it wasn't for adults? Yeah, I guess Jack Skellington never talks about MTV or why he hates minorities. They don't talk about that on Family Guy. Talk about what? MTV. God, I could never have the house to myself. What, are you so fat now you fill all the rooms up? No, I just like peace and quiet when macking on these online bitches. Oh my God, is our house gonna end up on Dateline again? Dateline? What, do you like teenage girls or something? Uh, when you say teenage, how old are we talking here? That was way more words than no. Why is everyone a goddamn ageist? Dude, nobody cares. Just go in your basement and prey on children. Fine, dumb bitch. They're not children. They're overdeveloped middle schoolers. That's... that's swell. Oh, you know what would actually cure my depression? Marilyn Manson's gonna be in town. At MCI? Next Friday. I thought you wanted to see Marilyn Manson. I do. Then why'd you bring up the Ice Cube movie? No, not next Friday the movie. Next Friday the time. Oh, got you. Yeah, let's do it. Cool. And I know a guy who can get us ecstasy, so it's gonna be an extra good concert. What does that do? Is it like PCP? No, it's not like fucking PCP. That's for like the saddest drug addicts. So is ecstasy for the happiest drug addicts? Literally, yes. Oh, cool. I'm down. Plus, Marilyn's just a great show anyway. Yeah, he's kind of hot in a kidnap me sort of way. He's like the one man on earth I want to trap me in a hotel room and sexually abuse me. Yeah, you seen the YouTube videos where he just goes on stage and says that? What is it about fame and money that makes us want to ignore a man's flagrant warning signs? Because a rock star traumatizing you is something to actually brag about? True. Letting a Denny's cook do that just makes you feel worthless. This is the county police. We have a warrant to search this residence. Oh, yeah. What you're looking for is in the basement. Uh, but I haven't made you aware of the charges. Oh, we're aware. Just a moment. But yeah, Manson could, like, cut me with broken glass and lick the blood off. It's cool because he's famous. Yeah, I want some rock star welts all over my ass so I can show off at the mental ward. Actually, same. Can you get us backstage? No, I can't afford the drugs and the VIP. Oh, well, hopefully he sees how hot we are and picks us out of the crowd. Bitch, we're on the upper level. Yeah, I'd need a whole telescope to notice us. Ugh, I didn't do anything wrong! Tell it to the judge. That girl barely looked 12! <laughs> Yeah, do you think your dad could give us money for better seats? Seats? My dad won't even give me the time of day. You're under arrest for three counts of digital misconduct with a minor and two counts of child pornography. No, that was an 18-year-old midget in my hot kid's folder. Dude, your dad's lame. Tell it to the judge. Hey, can you guys keep it down? We're trying to have a conversation in here. Yeah, honestly. Oh, sorry. You're not going to help me? You're going to have to tell it to the judge. Let's go. It was an 18-year-old midget. Yeah, my dad would never just give me money for a better concert. That makes me feel a lot less bad about my dad killing himself. But you didn't fucking feel bad in the first place. You don't know that. I guess you do wear a lot of stud belts. So, next Friday? Yeah, next Friday, not the Ice Cube movie.